building number seven collapsed. There's not a word about it. Everybody admits there is no explanation for why building number seven collapsed. In most cities, this would have been one of the, this would have been the biggest building, 47 stories high. It can be ignored only because it was next to the, to the, to the towers. From the viewpoint of the televised footage, we can clearly see the outline of World Trade Center 7 as it falls. Fire for hours, uh, and the smoke just seemed to intensify, um, but we really couldn't see a lot of damage from uh, this angle, from the north side of the uh, structures. Um, that's why everybody was so surprised when all of a sudden it just, it just fell. I just never for the life of me thought that these huge buildings that have been here so long would actually just fall. And, and, that's, and that's what happened. They, they, just, they just crumbled. Now let's use forward and reverse to analyze the shock wave that ripped through the building. You know, we heard this, this sound that sounded like a clap of thunder. Turned around, we were shocked to see that the building was, uh, uh, well, it looked like there was um, a shock wave uh, ripping through the building and the windows all uh, busted out and, you know, it was, it was horrifying. And then, uh, you know, about a second later, the bottom floor caves out. And uh, the building followed after that, and um, we saw the building crash down all the way to the ground. Um, you know, we were in shock. Difficulties around the area. New Jersey Transit outbound oh, Holbrook and Terminal oh, operating oh, on a load and go oh, basis. No inbound service. And also out of Newark Penn Station, limited service on the Northeast Carter and North Jersey uh, coastlines and the Raritan line as well. And limited service from Penn Station and New York into Penn Station and Newark and no service into the city on New Jersey Transit. Also, New Jersey Transit operating on a load and go basis out of New York's Penn Station. Well, Al, uh, I, I didn't realize because the other towers are so big, but uh, number seven is 47 stories. People starting to run away from the scene, and I turned in time to see uh, what looked like a, a skyscraper implosion. It looked like it had been done by a demolition crew. The whole thing just collapsing down on itself, and another big, huge plume of uh, gray and white smoke shooting up into the air, and then uh, more of the smoke billowing up the street here. Once again, our definition of a pyroclastic flow. Hot gases carrying dust and debris flow along the ground with a fluid motion. It requires explosive energy to generate the necessary heat, dust, and debris. Turbulence and fluidization of debris are characteristic. Let's watch the fall of Seven World Trade again, this time with Rick's original audio. Mount Pinatubo's eruption illustrates the fluid movement of the pyroclastic flow. Difficulties around the area, New Jersey Transit outbound, oh, Holbrook and Terminal operating on a load and go basis, no inbound service, and also out of Newark's Penn Station, limited service on the Northeast Carter and North Jersey uh, coastlines and the Raritan line as well, and limited service from Penn Station and New York into Penn Station and Newark, and no service into the city on New Jersey Transit, also New Jersey Transit operating. I remember getting a call from the uh, fire department commander telling me that they were not sure they were going to be able to contain the fire. And I said, you know, we've had such terrible loss of life. Maybe the smartest thing to do is, is pull it. Uh, and they made that decision to pull. And then we watched the building collapse. Around the area, New Jersey Transit outbound, Holbrook and Terminal operating on a load and go basis, no inbound service. And also out of Newark's Penn Station, limited service on the Northeast Carter and North Jersey uh, coastlines and the Raritan line as well. And limited service from Penn Station and New York into Penn Station and Newark. And no service into the city on New Jersey Transit. Also, New Jersey Transit operating on a load.